So now let's talk a little bit about ketogenic food options. But first, let's remember exactly what a ketogenic lifestyle would look like. A ketogenic lifestyle is, number one, a carbohydrate restriction in order to get blood sugars under control. Moderate protein consumption with most of your energy coming from fat. So what does that look like? It's personalized. This can fit you and your preferences. So whether you're lactose intolerant, a vegetarian, a vegan, or have any other food restrictions, this can work for you and what you enjoy. Let's begin with breakfast. So many options for breakfast. If you're someone who bacon and eggs sounds great for, then have it and enjoy it. But if you're a vegetarian who'd much prefer a full fat yogurt with berries, that is a great option as well. And now you can enjoy your coffee in the morning with full fat cream. And boy, does that start off the day great. And these can be eaten at home, but they can also be at a restaurant. How about some full fat Thai curry? How about salmon with Alfredo sauce? So many different salad options, and let's remember with the salad, you can have it with full fat dressing. So many different things. A sandwich without the bread. Most places, even fast food places, will let us wrap your burgers or your chicken sandwiches. And what about snacks? Well, when we talk about snacks, the one thing we need to mention first is to remember that a ketogenic lifestyle is not calorie restricted. So in the past, maybe you've been told no eating between meals. But if you get hungry in between meals, the instruction to you is have a snack and enjoy it because there are plenty of wonderful snack options. Maybe you want vegetables dipped in full fat dip, nuts, meat and cheese, the list goes on and on. Now, how about dinner? I mean, sometimes if you're running home from work, you may just wanna stop somewhere and pick up something. And again, the options of locations to be able to do this are endless. You could get a salad bowl from Chipotle, or you can go home and cook so many delicious things. Grilling out, or in the winter especially, wonderfully delicious creamy crock pot and casserole dishes. This is something that can be enjoyed by the entire family because these foods are delicious and satisfying. Now, what about desserts? Because that's another concern of people. Well, what will I do if I can't ever have another dessert? And the answer is don't think about that because that's not what's going to happen. Desserts can be enjoyed. There are so many wonderful things that can be eaten. In fact, you can even bake things. We use non-grain-based flours and we use sugar substitutes, chocolate, berries and cream. The list goes on and on. So desserts do not have to leave your life because you're restricting carbohydrates in order to get your blood sugar under control. Use food as medicine. We used to know this. We used to practice this. And then we got a bit off track because pharmaceuticals were available and seemed to be the much easier choice. But if you could just change what you were eating and get off the medications, what you'd be doing is going back to what we used to know, using food as medicine.